Hi, I'm Jeff Hale, founder of J. Hale Music. I've been providing quality archtop guitars and accessories to jazz guitarists around the world since the year 2000. Today I'd like to show you a uh, Heritage Eagle Classic that is uh, coming to our inventory. And although this looks like a brand new instrument, it was made in 1995, very, very well cared for. So it's a used instrument. The uh, Eagle Classic is very much like uh, the uh, Heritage Golden Eagle, except it's got two built-in pickups rather than a single floating pickup, and a few differences in the inlays and bindings. This is much uh, more like the Gibson L5 CES. Now, uh, the construction is hand-carved. We have a hand-carved and beautifully arched spruce top with very tight grain. The uh, rims are solid maple, and rim depth is three inches. We have a two-piece carved and beautifully arched maple back. You can see the uh, beautiful figure in this maple. It's really a gorgeous gu guitar. It has single cream binding on the uh, top and on the back. We have bound F-holes. Uh, all the hardware is uh, gold plate. Trapeze style tailpiece from Heritage. Compensated ebony bridge. The uh, two gold shallower pickups. Uh, that uh, are oftentimes used by Heritage. We have a matching uh, color pickguard. The maple pickguard matches the maple on the rest of the guitar. We have dual volume and tone controls with the traditional three-way switch. The neck is uh, three, uh, actually five-piece maple. There's three major pieces of maple. And you can see the two runners that go up the, uh, the sides of the center piece of maple, which make it into a five-piece neck. Grover Imperial tuners. We have ebony fingerboard. The uh, width of the neck at the nut is one and three quarter inches, 25 and a half inch scale length. Ebony overlay on the uh, front of the headstock. So, beautiful guitar. And as you heard, it has a, a wonderful acoustic tone. This has got the uh, flat wound strings on it right now. And if you put uh, uh, round wound strings on it, it would, it would be even uh, a bigger acoustic tone. But it's very impressive right now. And if we play it with a pick, just listen to it acoustically. Very full, very rich, big uh, uh, acoustic tone. Now if we play it amplified, we're going to play it through an Acoustic Image Claris 2R amplifier that's uh, connected to a Razor's Edge 68ER cabinet. And we're going to play it uh, through the neck pickup to begin with. pick up sound from the uh, from these great shallower humbucking pickups and the uh, combination of flat wound strings really gives it a great jazzy sound so let's recap this instrument it's a it's a beautiful 1995 heritage eagle classic looks like it's brand new doesn't have a, a mark on it very well cared for uh, everything is in great shape there isn't anywhere on the frets there aren't any uh, any uh, uh, dings or cracks or anything like that. You can see it's just a gorgeous instrument. It's hand carved construction with tightly grained spruce arched top, bound F holes. Rim depth is three inches. We have solid maple rims. Beautifully flamed and figured uh, uh, maple back, two piece maple back that's uh, hand carved. We have a uh, five piece uh, maple neck, three major pieces of maple with the uh, rosewood runners going up on the uh, opposite sides of the centerpiece. Uh, Grover Imperial tuners, ebony fingerboard, 25 and a half inch scale. We have one and three quarters at the nut and a nice ebony overlay, uh, which is traditional on the uh, headstock of the Heritage guitars with the Heritage insignia. So, great guitar. Uh, <laughs> I 
always like it when heritage guitars come in. They're just uh, they're just beautiful instruments. Every one of them is a work of art. And this is no exception. I always say you can never have too many guitars. This is a great example. Why don't you give us a call and make this uh, this guitar yours? Thanks a lot. Bye.